everybody, it's Kath from Her Fashion Box and today we're here with Melissa from Path to Wellness who um, is an absolute expert in, I guess, making you be the best you can be, which is what we love for Her Fashion Box. And we're interviewing Melissa as part of our Her Fashion Box Influencer Series, which we're running up the next month. So, hello, how are you? I'm so good, thank you for having me. My absolute pleasure. So can you give us a rundown on how you got started and how you got to where you are today? Well, about four years ago, I kind of hit rock bottom in my life. I was running around at a million miles an hour, I was an actress and a professional dancer and kind of burning the candles at both ends and um, looking for happiness in all of the wrong areas. Yeah. I, my measure of happiness and success was determined by how much money I earned, the boyfriend, um, the designer handbag and how skinny I was. And I created um, all of that to kind of go up in the air yeah. and for me to really stop and look at myself and look within and as a result I have discovered this journey of inwardness and self-love and the rest is kind of history it's been amazing I discovered the importance of holistic nutrition and went and studied holistic nutrition and life coaching and now I work with women one-on-one -on, -one on retreats workshops, blog, on my blog, um, within my book, um, I share with women on how to be the best version of themselves. Mm. That's my, my main mission and I just want to be able to support women and help them truly shine and help them break down all of their limiting barriers that we create in our head and I talk about the mean girl a lot in my blog which is that nasty little voice that's like you're not good enough and you're not pretty enough and you're not skinny enough and I really want to help women shine above all of that. My book's called 12 Steps to Wellness and it's basically the 12 steps I took to really transform my health and my life. So what have been some of your most memorable career moments? My most memorable career moments, probably this April I ran my first retreat, okay. which was unbelievable in Bali. Um, I took over about 20 girls and the transformation from when they walked in to when they left was just amazing. Watching them really shine was just so beautiful. And what are you currently obsessed about or what, what are you loving at the moment? I'm obsessed with being present at the moment. Yeah. I guess that might sound a little bit woo-woo, but for me it's something that I really focus on, something that I really want to um, go through my life and, and just be more present and there's other things that I love that I'm not, not obsessed with but I love yoga yeah. and I love being in the sun, I love um, riding yeah. and I love surrounding myself with beautiful people. Yeah. And who inspires you the most or what inspires you day to day? Everyone I have in my life inspires the pants off me, <laughs> like <laughs> honestly I believe that the five most prominent people in your life are a direct reflection of you and if you're hanging around people that are unmotivated and living a certain way, you're going to be like that as well. Sorry. Can you give us a rundown on a typical day of the life of Melissa? You know, my day looks like um, I wake up with the sun and will either come down here and watch the sunrise and meditate and do some yoga or I'll train with my trainer or something like that and I take time for myself every day. Do you have any exciting projects coming up in the future? I've got a hardcover book coming out. Amazing. Yeah. That's exciting. Very exciting. Um, and I'm working on doing, I just finished a tour um, of all these beautiful events that I was doing called Babes Not Bears. Yep. And the response blew me out of the water. I've seen all the photos. Yeah, like we sold out in every state. There's going to be some more events definitely towards the end of the year. Obviously we're at beautiful Bondi today and what do you most love about living in Bondi? How could you not love living here? Look at it, it's freaking phenomenal. Yeah, it's the ocean for me is so spiritual and so healing. And, and what are your, your five or your top beauty essentials and health essentials for glowing skin? I use coconut oil, tea tree oil for spots. Okay, good to know. I actually use coconut oil as my cleanser and my makeup remover and my moisturizer. Great. <laughs> um, so I have coconut oil and tea tree oil and then a shampoo and conditioner. Really? That's it. And what are your top well-being tips for all the girls and all your fans watching today? Clean, filtered water. Okay. 
is so it's so simple like but we forget to drink water yeah. and we're so dehydrated mm. um, and if you're eating a highly processed diet um, or a stressed you need more water mm. you know your body's trying to work overtime so we need a lot of water to help flush out any toxins but as again you know I had a coconut water as I was walking down here coconut water's great um, green juice, green yep. smoothies, they're all amazing things that are so supportive for your skin um, that are going to help you glow from the inside out. I believe real beauty comes from within. One of the main things that I work with women on is that voice inside their head, that mean girl voice um, that says, you know, those things like you're not good enough and you're not worthy of love and you're not pretty enough, you're not skinny enough, you don't, you're not going to earn enough money, all those nasty things and everybody has at least one of those things that their mean girl says to them, or boy, whoever's watching, yeah. um, that say to them on a daily basis. And we have something between like 60 to 80,000 thoughts a day. And a lot of those are negative, mean girl, toxic thoughts. And I just want people to really realize that they have a choice. Absolutely. And they don't have to subscribe to those thoughts they can choose to, to, or they can choose to not, not listen to it. So thank you so much, Melissa, for speaking to us and sharing your absolute wisdom and hot tips. And we look forward to following your journey and thank you for inspiring us. Thank you for having me. Thank you.